And now the thoughts for the week. Rejoice with joy unspeakable and full of glory. The true source of joy is not in things. Growth in grace increases our capacity for joy. A mind burdened with anguish cannot know the joy of righteousness. Righteousness is a state of being, and joy it's, is its emanation. One may not be happy, but one can live joyously. Finally, be happy. And now Dr. Lyle will give us our meditation for this morning. Let's take this opportunity to go within. Let's first clear our mentalities. Allow the thoughts and cares of the day, the week, to dissipate. Take a moment of silence. Let us go within. Lord Jesus, take each of us by the hand. Lead us gently up the little path through the narrow gate, through the Holy of Holies, into the kingdom of God where all is righteousness. Here each of us is one with the Father. We thank thee, Father, that thou hast heard us. Thou hearest us always. We have entered into that quiet place within each of us. It is at this time we can place in the thoughts that become the seeds to our life pattern. Those thoughts that we place in at this time come to fruition within the days to come. It is a continual process of planting and harvesting and being mindful of the thought that we reap what we sow. Let's take this time to carefully plant thoughts of love. Love of God, love for ourselves as his creation, love for our family, our friends, our relatives, our loved ones, all mankind. Love of the gifts that we've been given. Love of the gift of life. Place in, place in thoughts of harmony. the symmetry and beauty of the world, of the universe. And the opportunity to glance at a National Geographic magazine, within there they were discussing the universe and how they I've already discovered more than 370 planets similar to ours and that they believe in all probability that there are billions of planets similar to ours out there. Plant the seed of unlimited expansion and growth. 
the seat of openness to accept new ideas, new thoughts. Place in the thoughts of righteousness, of peace, of joy. And we thank thee, Lord Jesus, for leading us in the way of truth that frees, the perfect love that casteth out fear, the peace which passes all understanding, and the way of eternal life. Amen. Now join me in the Lord's Prayer. <clears throat> Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Let us not be led into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever. Amen.